Hi, this is Travis at US Water Systems. Today we're going to replace carbon media. After you unscrew the control valve, you'll be left with a tank full of wet media and water. Depending on how many helpers you have and what you have nearby, you may be able to siphon the water out first. You can actually use some 3 8 tubing, slide the 3 8 tubing all the way down the distributor and then just siphon it out into a, into a floor drain or a bucket. Once you're left with just media, you may or may not be able to remove this distributor tube. For this demonstration, I'm going to pull the distributor out beforehand. Your media will be wet, but in this demonstration, we're using dry media. With the wet media, you'll have to do quite a bit of shaking in order to get it out. The wet media is going to be pretty heavy, so you're probably going to need assistance lifting up the tank to empty it out. When you're ready to load the media, the distributor tube will go into an empty tank. We cover the top of the distributor tube. We're covering the distributor tube so that when we pour the carbon media in, nothing goes down the tube. Depending on the size of the tank will determine how much media you need. If you have any questions on how much media goes in your size tank, we can always get that answer for you. You can give us a call and we'll let you know exactly how much media you need. Use our funnel made for loading media. We're going to load the media in. We're going to use a respirator mask to protect our lungs from the fines when we pour it in. And then we can remove this duct tape. And you can kind of center it by twisting. Get it right in the center there. And if you're using a carbon media, you can fill this with water and soak it to help saturate the carbon. You can use a garden hose. Um, if not, if you don't have that ability, then you would just go ahead and screw the control valve on and just slowly turn the bypass on and allow water to fill up the tank slowly. At this point, your carbon has been replaced. You're going to do this on an average of about every five years. And if you have any questions, give us a call at 1-800-608-USWA. Thanks for watching.